get ready me for bed but i'm doing it on the floor because i just feel like it i didn't do get ready me today because i feel really ill and i just couldn't really be bothered and i just didn't want to put any makeup on because what's the actual point if i'm ill i've got to be a bit quiet yeah because i'm like sat next to my door i like my brother's room it's right next door and my mum will kill me if i wake him up but basically i'm just using my new micellar water bottle that i bought from primark yesterday and i'm just cleansing my face yeah with micellar water to get all the access to it my face right, i'm a bit bored of whispering i'm just gonna have my quiet voice on you know but basically this girl told me that if you double cleanse and it helps your skin so i've been double cleansing lately and it has helped so i put micellar water on on because it's a water-based cleanser and then i also cleanse my face with um cerave gel cleanser okay i look a state because i've just drowned my face in water and i'm going to show you what i do because i never ever include this step like on video so all i'm doing is i use this to cleanse my face at night i've literally been using this for the past year my go-to cleanser this is one thing in my skincare routine that i'll never change like the color of the bowl might change but the actual product never change i'm just gonna go wash my face so right, i feel rougher than before but it's fine we're gonna move do my moisturizer now i'm using my favorite one indu moisturizer of course it's, it's really nice and cold because it was in my fridge I'm using like literally a pea size, not even a pea size of retinol. Literally the tiniest bit ever. And it's also cold because it's been in my fridge. Just to help my skin, you know. I think that was more than a pea size, but it's fine. I'm using this now. And now I'm all ready for bed. Get ready with me for school. By the way, guys, I've been using these Tyrell lip plumper patches and my lips have been like way more hydrated. Look at the cute packaging. I'm actually going to do one now because it literally takes one minute. Like so. <laughs> Just trust me. <laughs> Then you take this and you massage. Okay. Look, look at that plump. And there's zero burning or irritation. So yeah, I've literally been using that once a week and like my lips have been so hydrated. By the way, guys, yes, I still have mascara on from last night because I'm a lazy piece of shit. I also was too lazy to wash my hair even though I had to. And so now we're doing like this slick back. We're just <laughs> looking like I literally look like an egg. I've been loving this Giorgio Armani concealer that they sent me. This is crazy to say, but it might be beating my NARS concealer. I'm going to try the bronzer. They sent me the shade West Coast. I think I'm going to use this Patrick Ta. Okay, it's very, like, natural. I feel like the mascara is actually not that bad for having, like, slept on it for nine hours. One thing about me, guys, is that nothing is affecting my sleep. Like, I'm a very anxious person, but it won't affect my sleep. If I have a big test that I didn't study for, I'm not staying up till like 2 a.m to study on school nights my limit is like 10 p.m and that's mostly because i'm someone who literally cannot function if i don't have at least eight hours of sleep like of course it happens on weekends like i go out and stuff but halloween is coming up i can't wait i've changed costume ideas so many times but i think i found it i'm gonna put my new fave which is the ysl candy guys you guys keep asking the shade hold on it's the shade 15 and my lips look this good because of the Lip Plumper Patches by Tarell. Bye, guys!
And here is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoy this style of get ready with me. Um, I love you so much, and I will see you later. Bye. Hey, guys. Get ready me for bed. So I just had practice, and I'm about to go take a shower. But first, I'm taking off my, um, what's it called? Makeup stuff. I'm taking my mascara off is what I meant to say. So, yeah. So I'm going to do that quick. I just had tacos, and they were really good, but I'm sad that they weren't fresh. I literally want to go to bed right now. I'm so tired, but I have to shower. Like, I put, um, what's it called? My slick back stuff in my hair. So my hair, if I take it out, I'll actually take it out. Let's see what I'm dealing with for my hair. Great! So yeah, this is actually what my hair looks like. So I'm going to need to wash it. I'll be back soon. I came back. I just got out of the shower. First thing I'm doing is putting lotion all over my body because I'll get super itchy if I don't. Okay, now I'm like all lotioned up. So I'm going to get started on my actual skincare. I'm also going to use a little bit of, like, the oil leave-in conditioner stuff because it makes my hair really soft. So, yeah, I'm just going to put this stuff in, and then I need my serum that I use. I'm using the serum stuff, too. This is from Lanza. They sent me this. To, I don't know if you guys saw my PR that I did, but this stuff is, like, so good. Like, I'm not even joking. I use it literally every day. Okay, now my hair is all set. I'm going to use my toner. and just put that everywhere. Well, 3 o'clock today is when Broke My Day actually started. So, I went to work and then um, worked until 7. I had practice at 7.30, so I had no time to go home because it's like a 20-ish minute drive. And I was like, I was supposed to leave at 7, but I was like on the phone doing something. So, I had to like stay. And then I had work, I mean, lacrosse until 8, I think 8.45 maybe i don't know i don't know when it ends actually to be completely honest so then i got home at like 10 because like it's like a 30 minute drive back um and um for like maybe 25 minutes and then i literally like just got home so i'm just like very ready for bed right now i don't know why i look so pale this lighting is not doing me justice so yeah but i'm ready to go to bed Oh, that was a little bit much. It's, uh, it's I. There's a hair on my face. I feel like, like, I was looking at my videos, and I realized how aggressively I rub my products in my face. So I'm going to start light and gently rubbing them into my face. Just like this, nice and gentle. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace. Get ready with me for a birthday party. Again. Oh my god. So I literally had a birthday party yesterday and today I have another one. So, um, yeah. I always put on way too much of this freaking toner. Anywho, I slept with my hair in these braids because I want wavy hair today. So don't mind my, like, hair. It's not looking too good right now. And trust me, I know. Anyways, tomorrow is school. I don't want to talk about it. Okay, let's move on now. I also have a volleyball meeting later, and so does this other girl that's also going to the same birthday party. So we're just going to take her to the meeting with us. I don't really know what to talk about. Nothing is... No. Okay, since I want my skin to be, you know, nice and soft, I'm going to put on some of my dew drops. I just realized that I'm literally getting ready an hour early. I have no clue why. I know it's literally October, but I cannot wait for this school year to be over. Because I'm not going to the high school that I'm supposed to go to, um, so I finally get to never see all these annoying people ever again. I'm just so ready for a change, and I cannot wait to leave. Okay, I got this new bronzer cream from Glossier, so we're gonna try it. Okay, I took it off, so I'm just gonna go in with my regular bronzer. I really feel like most kids my age are really scared of change, and I don't know why, because you only live once, so... Because me personally, I am ecstatic that I'm moving schools. I literally look so freaking busted right now, I cannot wait to take out these braids. Oh, and I literally completely forgot to say, thank you so much for fi- Ooh. Okay, I literally have no freaking clue what just happened. But what I wanted to say was thank you so much for 15k. Thanks, Ray. Okay, I'm gonna go do my lashes and be right back. 
Okay, lashes are done and um, they look okay. So let's just move on. You know what I hate? I hate people who think they know everything about me from one video and then there are my comments being like, uh, no, that's not right. It's like this. I'm like, you don't know me, okay? You don't know me. Okay, I'm just putting some eyeliner. Some rare beauty. Ooh, satisfying. <sighs> too much. Ooh. Oh my god. Ooh. Oh my god. That's too much. Okay, I fixed the highlighters. I'm gonna go set. Okay, I just took out my hair and I put in some hairspray. I'm just not touching it yet because I don't want it to fall. Anyways, perfume of the day is Victoria's Secret Bombshell. I love this stuff. Okay, anyways, fit check. Lulu, Lulu, and Nike. So that's it. Bye, guys. Get ready with me. I'm getting ready for a football game. And it's not like a high school football game, it's like an NFL football game. It's supposed to be absolutely freezing, so hopefully I don't freeze myself, so I'm gonna wear three layers. I honestly don't care about football at all. I'm just going for the tailgate, which is like where we eat all the food. Because my dad makes like a lot of food for this, so yeah. Actually, I'm kind of scared. My sister just reminded me that last tailgate, we had this like disgusting bear soup. Like, I swear there was literal bear meat in the soup. Like, it was the most disgusting thing I've ever tasted. And it smelled, oh my god, it smelled so bad too. And that was, like, the only food there. So I basically starved, like, the whole game. The reason he made that gross soup is because we were against, like, the bears. And I'm pretty sure it's because we were going to, like, destroy the bears. But I'm pretty sure we lost anyways. Um, the Giants, which is the team that we're, like, rooting for, low-key, like, suck. But don't even worry, my dad will still be cheering for them in every single game. My dad is like a diehard Giants fan. Like he buys seasonal tickets like every single year. That's the only reason that I'm going to this game right now. And like he gets the exact same spot every year for like six seats. So my sister's bringing her friend and then I'm bringing my boyfriend. My boyfriend keeps asking me like all these random questions. Like, have you never been to a flipping football game before? Forgot highlighter. Okay, I think I'm gonna get rid of these. I've had them since like July, so I'm gonna start using my new ones. My dad is taking his old car, and his old car is literally so like bumpy. Oh my god, I'm just gonna. Like, my dad literally bought like a really new, nice car a couple months ago, and he like barely uses it. It's so annoying. Like, if you're gonna buy a car, freaking use it. It's like 8 15 right now, so I'm probably gonna sleep in the car because it's still like pretty early. I swear, new mascara literally looks so good all every time. I'm using my purple one because I don't see a real pink. Guys, I just got these sweatpants. Everyone, go buy them. Okay, this is the set with yeah. my humongous jersey. Okay, bye guys. Good morning, it's finally the end of the season. Come get ready me for one last game day. Not gonna lie, the odds of us winning tonight are probably like a 1 out of 10, really low. We have to wear our blue little t-shirt thing, so I'm really hoping that I have time to curl my hair later. A little good old friend of mine invited me to a party this upcoming Saturday and I was like, oh my gosh. And then it was like, bring a swimsuit and I was like, oh my gosh. I was literally in chem class and decided to go to the bathroom just to order a bikini. So I'm hoping it like fits, you know, it's coming like tomorrow. Listen, I don't think I've ever shit talk anybody who hasn't done me dirty or done me wrong. But like, I have friends that'll literally shit on everybody. I'll be like, oh my god, did you see so-and-so's Instagram picture? And they're like, ew, she's so ugly. And I'm like guys <laughs> like that's just being insecure like obviously everybody has insecurities you know we all do but you don't have to bring other people down to make yourself feel better about yourself my mom and i will have this little competition that like whenever we're like in an airport or something together or literally anywhere like go up to somebody and compliment them and literally makes their day so much better i swear it'll make your day better too because it's so much harder to be mean to somebody than just be nice tonight i watched lights out with my parents and now i'm literally scarred if you cannot do horror movies do not do that movie i swear okay it's 6 49 we have to leave by 7 so i'm gonna go ahead and get changed and then we'll brush this out and finish makeup Finish my hair. It's a little fluffy right now. Hopefully that'll die down a tad bit. Okay, here's my fit. I got some jewelry. This is from Amazon. I gotta put it on in the car. This is from school. Blue bag. Got our handout leggings from Amazon. School or er, volleyball bag. Blazers. And that's about it. <laughs> I hope you all have a great Monday morning and I'll talk to you later. Bye.